me Troy McLean and welcome to my channel. Yes, we are in March. They had a bit of a, an, an oopsie daisy when they had items delivered. They shared it with all of us. But Geek Gear's February box is now being distributed to everybody on the globe who has subscribed. And mine arrived yesterday. Ah! Gotta say, I am really excited about this because bearing in mind, they posted that photograph to let us all know. If you haven't seen, this is the photo to say that at the moment they were struggling, they'd had a delivery and unfortunately the delivery looked like obviously we weren't told what had happened and what it was but it looked like everybody, everything had arrived broken um, which obviously is awful for anybody so they had to postpone slightly by a few days the distribution of the rest of the Geek Gear subscription boxes but as I said mine arrived yesterday and I'm really excited because I'm feeling so much better, yay! I've been ill for two weeks and I feel amazing so I'm really excited to see what's in this box. If you would like me to bring Hogwarts to you, then why not subscribe to my channel? Let's get started. <gasps> now, as you can see, I'm in my Nocturne Alley section today. Um, I've been filling it with a few different things. My potion shelf is now gone. As you have seen by this photo, my potions have now moved to the other side of the room. But I now have my beautiful Bellatrix Lestrange Dagger by Neighbor Collection as an early birthday present to moi. Now here it is, Geek Gear subscription, February 2020. Let's get started and open it. Now straight away we have a, looks like a poster. So the only hints we have had are these three hints here. So it's always interesting because I never ever guess correctly. <laughs> Obviously I know where the, what film it is and so on and where it, you know, what part, what scene and so on but I can never guess correctly. So let's have a look and see. What's that? And it's a t-shirt, what is it? Swedish short snout. Oh, look, I love that. I know that they've been doing, but they've been changing the color of their cardboard spaghetti and mine is blue. I'm not sure if everybody else's is blue, but mine is blue and I love that. So here we have a t-shirt. Oh, and I changed the size of mine because my last one was really small. That's gonna fit me no problem. Oh my God, I love it. Look at that. Swedish short snout. Look at that. Oh, you like it a lot. That is so, so lovely. That is such a lovely colour. Again, it's blue, isn't it? I, I love, I love my blue. <laughs> As you all know, I like my blue. I'm not going to chuck all this, uh, these cardboard spaghetti out of the box this time because last time it took me, because I've got carpet in here, it took me forever to pick it up. So I, I can see a wand. So let's get the wand out first. So we have a noble wand. I can never read the cards on these because I can't understand half of what the card says. Oh, okay, there's no card with this one unless it's in the box. Ooh, that's pretty. Now remember that these, it looks like Geek Gear are finally um, allowing you, if you like a box and you haven't subscribed to it, they're allowing you to buy the previous boxes. If not, and you like an item specifically, you can also order those items separately when they become released on the website. So I don't know any other subscription box that does that. But look at that, how cool is that? It's like a dragon claw holding a ball at the top. And then you have like a, a brown ball there. And it's a fairly long wand. The thing I like about the Noble ones, again with Noble Collection and Noble, they're not connected in any way, but the Noble ones are very heavy. And you like a bit of weight, don't you, with your wand, you like a bit of weight. If you saw this video from last Severus Saturday, I showed you the limited edition collector's edition of the Wizarding World interactive wand from last year. And it's really light and I don't like that. 
So this is very, very nice. Very, very nice. I like it. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. That's going to look fantastic on my wand shelf. Now, recently, Geek Gear have been producing some really lovely items, a lot of replicas. Now, I think this might be the reason why there was a lot of breakages and people were so were, were waiting for their items. Let's have a look what it is. It's clearly glass. Beep, 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 beep. So I'm going to be incredibly careful opening this up. I hope you like my Nocturne Alley section. I actually um, exclusively revealed this for Leaky Cauldron last Halloween. Um, and I do love it here. I've had to move a load of stuff around because I'm actually changing, as I said, the look of things. And my shelves over on the other side as well have been changed. Oh, this is very sparkly. It's not very easy to get open, but I can see why they've done this carefully feels very weird. It's like a wax. Oh, okay. <laughs> what are we doing? It's meant to be sparkly, but I think because it's been in transit for so long and been laying flat, all the glitter has kind of accumulated at the bottom. So it's like when you, if you drink, I love unicorn gin, right? Zimagorian's a unicorn gin, okay? And if you, you pick that up, all the glitter has sunk to the bottom and you've properly got to do this with it to get the glitter to move. That's very pretty. It's still very stuck at the bottom, but that is an Amortentia bottle. Can you see that there? Look at that, and it's all sparkly like unicorn gin inside, but I highly recommend you do not try and drink this. It is not gin, okay? That is so pretty. In fact, I've just made a space on my potion shelf that's going on there straight away. Now, before we continue with the rest of the box, I'm gonna open the poster box. Now I like these pictures, but I don't know where to put them. I haven't really got anywhere left that I can. The items that I'm doing, because um, this is a Geek Gear one here, the Lucius Malfoy one was a Geek Gear poster. Now I will, if I get items like that, I will be filling this wall with wanted posters. Um, but other posters that aren't stuff like that, I've got nowhere to put them. <gasps> oh, M. Gee, I don't care where this is gonna go, but it is going up. Oh my God, seriously, that is amazing. I don't know what, I'm, I'm, geek gear, this is beautiful. Seriously, this is beautiful. This is one of the best things you've had in your boxes for so long, and I'm not normally excited about the posters. Oh. Another reason to get emotional. This is actually, my, my mum passed away, as you guys know, Geek Gear did a thing in January for me as we all watched Harry Potter together on the 23rd of January. This was her favorite scene in the Harry Potter films. So whenever I see it, I always get emotional. She was a huge Harry Potter fan. Geek Gear, wow, that's stunning. And the person who painted it, who, po who, who painted it, amazing. <sighs> Please excuse me. Oh, seriously, hats off to you, Geek Gear, for that one. Now I have uh, cleaned myself up a little bit. Let's continue. I love these. I love the blue. Ooh, 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 ooh. Very, very, very nice. Obviously a chess piece or something to do with chess. Oh, wow, it is a chess piece. Oh, wow, that's amazing. Look at the detail on that. Do you know it'd be great, right, for the next, I don't know how many pieces are in a chess board, but that they, that they release like chess pieces each week. I mean, I, I you know, it's, 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 a, it's a lot to ask, but, um, and then the board at the end of it or something, that'd be really cool. That's beautiful. I love that. Obviously you had the one in the Curia Curation of Magical Curiosities at Christmas, which was a red one, which was really pretty. Um, but this one's lovely, absolutely lovely. 
Oh, we got the information about the wand here. It is Draco Pez. Pez? Draco Pez? Uh, length 13 and a half, core, Occamy feather. Oh. Um, wood type, dark wood. There we are. We have a poster. When I can get the poster out. Ooh! You have nothing to fear if you have nothing to hide. Was that... It was the Minister of Magic, but I can't remember his blooming name. Rufus Scrimger, is it? No, it's not Rufus Scrimger. That doesn't sound right. It was, yeah. Ah! Ah! Anyway, the guy that Voldemort kills just because he speaks and he shouldn't have. Um, but yeah, that's what he said. That is a Harry Potter, the Warner Brothers exclusive, and it is an official item. There's something else in here. Hang on. My mistake. The charm is in here. <gasps> Now, I've got to be honest, people know that I wasn't 100% sure about the charm bracelet. Um, I didn't realise that, one, the charm actually did come undone, and two, that it was going to be a series of charms. Okay, that is lovely. I don't know if you can see that. It is an Amortantia Love Potion Charm bottle. Look at that. That is so pretty. I'm going to put that on the bracelet right now. So there we have it. We have the owl charm that was in the January Geek Gear box and the Amortentia Love Potion bottle, which is in the February Geek Gear box. Now, don't worry if you haven't got these boxes because these items will be available to buy on their website very, very soon. The only thing is if you don't subscribe to their boxes, you will be paying a little more for the items because I think these boxes are about £25. The link will be down below for you. If you're new to Geek Gear, however, there is a 10% discount for you. So make sure that you join because stuff like this is amazing. That print is the best thing in this box. This Amortentia bottle, I mean, that's so pretty. I love their stuff. The t-shirt, I am gonna wear it now. Seriously, I'm off to the cinema later. I'm ta we're taking Harry to go and see the new Sonic film. And I'm wearing this, I'm taking this off. It's really comfy. And it's a lovely size as well, because I changed the size to a unisex and it's much better. Right, let's have a look at what was in it. A massive thank you to all the Geek Gear um, for subscribing to Geek Gear Wizardry. We hope that you enjoyed every single item that we have currently packed into your box this month and that you continue to sub um, your subscription and remain a valued member of the growing Geek Gear community. Do you know Geek Gear is becoming one of the biggest subscription boxes out there and it's, be and it's well deserved too. February 2020, exclusive Swedish short snap t-shirt as model the Bemi. License and exclusive, Pious Thick Knees, fear print, Pious Thick Knees. Thank you, Geek Gear, I can't remember his blooming name. Uh, unique wand, exclusive Dragon Claw wand, obviously by Noble Wands, I assume. Um, Hogwarts Lake Community Artist Artwork. This stunning artwork is brought to you by Holly Simpson. Um, show Holly some love on Instagram, Holly Simpson Art. I'll put the link down below. Holly, you've done an incredible job on that picture. So beautiful. Sorry, I forgot to mention that the dra the, the claw wand was this month's wand is a community artist uh, design created by the incredibly talented Geek Gear customer, Kelly Blackburn. So well done, Kelly, for that. I actually have been thinking of maybe doing a few myself. Exclusive Wizard's Chest Piece Night Replica. Exclusive Amortentia Love Potion. That is going straight on the potion shelf. Exclusive Monthly Collection Charm Love Potion. That is beautiful, to be fair. And we've got Planning Your Crystal YouTube Spotlight. So you've got the YouTube Spotlight there. It's Planning Your Crystal. Kill. Next month's hint is Potions Class. I love me a bit of potions, I do. I love that. If you would like me to bring Hogwarts to you, then why not subscribe to my channel? If you like this video, then make sure you hit the like button. And also don't miss any more of my videos, hit the notification bell as well. Until next time, take care. I love you all. I'll speak to you very soon. Bye-bye. Make sure that you subscribe to my channel. Press the like button, the notification bell so you don't miss any more of my videos. Until next time, take care. I love you all. I'll speak to you very soon. Bye-bye.